Hello everyone, welcome back to Crypto Gains for another video. In this video, I need to show you some important charts. Stuff that people are not talking about and you need to see this. I'm specifically talking about this chart here. And it's going to really be a make or break for Bitcoin and, you know, the crypto space going forward. And I'm going to explain my reasons why. If this sounds interesting to you, please drop that like. Give me a subscribe if you're new watching. Over the time, I can see that my analysis has been quite spot on with crypto. Uh, showing you the Bitcoin chart is powerful because when Bitcoin goes up, the altcoin usually, uh, altcoins tend to go up with it. And if it falls, then obviously the altcoins we see a pull back. Before I dive into this, did I say it? I need to let you know. I don't know if I said it. I'm telling it again. I'm not a financial advisor. These are just my own personal opinions on the market. So please do your further research before you invest your money. I feel like I just said that. Anyway take a look at this chart what we are looking at right here is the weekly chart for the bitcoin price and like i said i'm watching the bitcoin price because when bitcoin rises the altcoins tend to rise with it and if it falls you know you usually see the price action come down on the altcoins we are looking at three lines moving averages we have the yellow line which you usually see that i show you which is the 21 uh, week moving average and then we have this blue line which is the 50 week moving average and then we have at the bottom the 200 week moving average and I put the 200 week there just to see where the bottom plays out and most of the time in the bull or bear market sorry we've always seen the price bounce off this you know uh, 200 week it's never broke it in a in, a, in a, the Bitcoin's trend this is sort of been where the bottom has been and you know that kind of holds true when you take it back to the past as well you can see right but just to make things super clean and super simple so i can show you what i'm trying to show you today is the two lines that i really want you to focus on the yellow line and the blue line i'm gonna take off the price of the crypto currency right now i just want to hide it because i want you to focus on these two lines and once you this is as simple as it can be and once you understand these two lines you'll understand the situation that i think we're in right now now let's take a look back every time we've seen the yellow line cross this blue line we have seen price action go down look at the price you see it go down and just to show you again i'm going to take it off every time it doesn't matter which cycle Every time we've seen this yellow line cross this blue line, so the blue line comes above, the yellow line's coming down, we have seen price action fall down. You can see it, right? And this holds true with regardless of which um, cycle you're in. If we take it even further back, have a look. Every time we've seen the yellow cross with the blue, we've seen the price fall down right so just turning it back off now one more time so look take a look the yellow cross the blue straight over here the yellow cross the blue and look where we are today guys it looks like the yellow could be coming up to cross the blue now there's i'm going to give you two scenarios because you know right now the market's looking great and ideally we would love to see price action keep going on and it potentially can there's a few of the scenarios that can happen with relations to this price but i want to keep it real you know i like to show you the good and bad if this scenario was to play out where the yellow crosses with the blue i me myself i am going to be planning to take some serious profits because then that will tell me that we might see a trend in this space where price action falls down and you can see it's happened many a times that price and we've and we've always come down to this red line here every time that's happened every time price action has been below the blue and the yellow you can see we've come straight down so and just to show you again that like every time it's been below the blue and the yellow we've come straight down to this red line and if that happens guys we're going to be seeing price actions down here minimum minimum we will see a price uh, at the worst i need to show you the worst and give you the good afterwards Fifteen thousand uh, pound dollar bitcoin that's the price that i'm looking at so if this happens and we see a cross it could be a seriously good time to consider taking profits 
Bitcoin is at a critical moment right now. It has to break above a certain price for it to, you know, remain bullish and to disregard this scenario that's happening that could happen right here. I hope it doesn't happen, right? But I just needed to bring it to your attention. I mean, what can happen with these lines is, you know, you could see this blue line go like this, you know, and then all of a sudden you could get some insane buy power with Bitcoin. Oh, let me just uh, change that back to blue. And then, you know, you may see this swoop run like this. And we've kind of seen something happen like this in the past. You know, that like, where they're so close together like this and they're both riding up. And I'll show you that right now. Um, a fine example of that is, uh, let me find it, right here. This scenario here. We had that similar scenario in 2013 cycle, from 2013 to 2014. But if you notice, it never ever crossed. You know, we went like it was going to cross with the blue. It never did. And it swooped up, massive all-time highs, and the blue was very close to it, and it, it rode up with it. Then after the top, that's where we saw the cross, right? So that's what I'm really paying attention to. It's so important that you guys pay attention to this. If you want to grab it up, you can go on to tradingview.com, free to join. Grab, us, grab yourself some uh, indicators. Very simple, because once you sign up, you, you actually, let me show you first. You come over here. I've got the Brave liquid index for bitcoin chart you can just type in bitcoin it doesn't matter which which chart you use bitcoin and look over here i use the bit stamp that will grab up a chart and once you've got the chart click on indicators then type in moving average you can see it here the third one down you can click it three times and then you can set the parameters over here you can you know change this to 21 and then the other one you can change to 50 i think it's important that you guys should be looking at this because this is what's going to guide you on your journey um there is another scenario okay so i you know i want to bring out the worst case scenarios and just show you like some good scenarios uh i hope because you know we everybody's been looking at this 2013 2014 cycle thinking that that's the kind of cycle we're going to see you know where the massive drop down and then price is going to come back above and hopefully we, we float above Right, but there is one more scenario that can play out, and I know it's nothing like the 2017. Uh, let me just delete these because you know I don't want to confuse anyone there. Uh, the other scenario that can play out for this is that we see, and I'm just going to turn the price action off again, real quick, and then you'll understand why I'm saying uh, that this could be another scenario, right? So let me just turn this off. Another scenario is that we have what happened back in 2011 so this goes right back to uh september 2011 to uh well all the way to 2013 right this is that cycle so here this scenario here where the yellow crosses the blue right just like what i showed you in the other ones yellow crosses the blue but in this scenario it's short-lived so the yellow crosses the blue and it spins back around and we see another cross where the blue is underneath the yellow and then have a look at the price section now price is bouncing off this yellow and we continue to ride it up into the next part of the cycle now what the interesting thing is we've been looking at 2013 to 2014 like that was its own single bull run but technically speaking you know this entire run up this could have been one gigantic bull cycle and if that's the case that means we had two three top we had three tops so the first top would have been from 2011 it would have came down because if you look that was the bottom of the bull uh, of the bear, bear market right and then you can see they had uh so that would be that so i oh know two tops so yeah it would have come up in a well unless you want to count these that would have been the first top that would have been the second but this could have been one gigantic i look at this like one gigantic bull run i don't see it as you know you got 2013's bull cycle like that because we were looking at like 2013 to 2014 i don't see it like that little area is just i think this was the entire cycle looking at it like this and if that's the case then we could face something similar to this we had this price action go up we saw a massive drop down and then look have a look here look closely right we saw the yellow cross with the blue and it was short-lived and have a look how the cross happened before the price went up so you had this v-shaped recovery the cross came first and then the price went up it's a bit different where we are today um, but regardless of what it is i hope that we have something similar to this where it's sh if 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 it is to come down and cross with the blue it's going to be short-lived and then the yellow will sweep back up and we'll see another cross uh, soon how long did it take for the this cross here to get to this cross here it was roughly 
210 days. Uh, you're talking over eight months, guys, if this is to happen, which means there could be an additional further drop before we see a next move up, if that happens, right? So I just want to keep that on your radar. It's something important that you need to see. That's the worst case scenario. Now that's been said, let's take the best scenario for Bitcoin. I'm going to switch it to the daily time frame. I'm going to bring this up so we can see price action because something interesting is happening. And I'm going to take off the 21 day. We don't need that. We just need these two lines here, the 50 day and the 200 day. This is on the daily time frame. What you're looking at here is going to be called a golden cross. It does not happen often for Bitcoin or any crypto. So when this happens, it's a significant move. We saw the death cross happen here, which we thought we were going to see lower lows. Technically speaking, we did continue to see lows uh, from the point that the cross happened. But the golden cross is just as powerful. Sorry, I'm just trying to uh, delete these uh, things that I've done here. Uh, so let me just delete this as well. The reason the golden cross is powerful, because the last time I ever saw Bitcoin do a golden cross was a while ago. Look, let's take a look back on the daily. The last time we saw the blue cross above the red. And the last time you can see that it did it was right here. Right here. And the price of Bitcoin was around exactly at the cross. It was around £8,000. And the last time we saw Bitcoin cross like this, it went from 8000 uh, Sorry, I'm saying pounds, dollars. It went from $8,000 all the way up to $64,000, $65,000. That's how powerful these golden crosses are. And should that continue to play out like before, and we see this golden cross and prices rise, we could see some serious new highs for Bitcoin. It may you know, very well hit the 100,000 level. And just to show you again in the past, what, you know, what these golden crosses look like. So the prior one would have been this one here. We had a golden cross right here. Bitcoin's price was at roughly 4,000. You can see it here, 4,500. And then it rose all the way to 14,000. And it was fast, guys. It wasn't this slow movement. It happened quite quick. I remember this. It happened you know, relatively fast. So be prepared for that. That's another thing that I'm looking at for this golden cross. Should it happen, right? And it looks like it's going to happen. So that's a good scenario. Uh, so right now, Bitcoin is facing this line that I drew, showed you guys before, which is the 21. Uh, sorry, I'm saying 21. <laughs> I'm saying just drawing yellow lines and calling it 21. Uh, 52 uh, price tar uh, target, I think this one was, because it had been, you know, serious resistance on this. It was a, an important one to break. Is this 52? It says 51.8. Let me just bring it up a bit. 52 For me, the 52K level is important for Bitcoin to break. Because if it can break this 52, then, you know, we could see price action really go above. And this was like a strong resistance in my eyes. Uh, I don't know. I feel, I feel like it is, it's an important level for Bitcoin to break. But, you know. Everybody has their own version of what they, they think Bitcoin can break. Most people think, you know, Bitcoin has to come up to 54,000 and break that. Yeah, that's also another significant one as well. But uh, let's just see what happens. It might rip through both of these. Uh, well, that's the, I, you know, ideally we would like to see that. So, you know, I'm keeping my eye on that. And another thing you can, you know, really pay attention to in your own time if you want to grab it up is the Bitcoin rainbow chart. This is going to tell you if it's, you know, we really are going to be coming up to the top of the market or the bottom of the market. Always a good time to know when to sell and when to buy. Okay. Uh, one last thing, actually, before I go, I'm trying to figure out which chart to grab it up on. Maybe I'll grab it up on this one. Uh, where is it here? I wanted to show you guys. Uh, let me find it. Let's just take off the moving average for a second. I want to show you guys. Uh, hold on a minute. Uh, what's it called? It's called the growth. Hold on, growth. Hold on, bit. <laughs> I usually cut this on kind of Bitcoin log. Hold on, it's not coming up. Here we go. Bitcoin log. Look, this is how you find. There we go. Log growth curves. I want to show you this because bit just like I told you with this 52k level, there's a, a middle line. Right, and this is what we've been seeing in Bitcoin's uh, chart for the longest time. You know, the last time it came up to this middle line on the log growth curves, and you can see here it's these lines here, right? And just to really zoom out to give you a better picture of what it looks like, um, it, it almost looks a bit like the rainbow chart, but you know, it's more defined, you can see things more clearly. Every time we went up to this middle line, this is what I'm trying to get at, right? Every time we got to this middle line here, right here. 
you can see that it's been either great support or heavy resistance and in this case you know from when it went down to 14k it held as resistance bitcoin couldn't break it and it got rejected and then we saw a lower low right so you know that's something i really want to you know keep on your mind there pay attention to that you can grab it up just like i did you saw how i did it we were above it we came below it we're testing it again guys we are testing this middle line again and that's why i say this 52k level is important because it matches up perfectly to this log growth curve if it breaks it and then we print candles above hopefully we can see it right above guys i think it's going to happen fast if we break this we're going to see new all-time highs really really fast because every time it's broken it, it shot up high really really fast and you can also see this in the past as well i'm just gonna shrink it a little bit and bring it back just to show you what it looked like when we did break it like the last time we broke it 2017 was here so from here just you know just from here this break right here we broke it there and then look how long did it take from there this break to here to get to the top of this cycle right here i'm going to bring down this because it's just in the way at the minute uh let me just bring this down at the minute here we go i really want to focus your attention on this so it basically took from here from breaking this middle line on the log growth curves to here at the top of the market see measuring it up 67 days so roughly two months so what i can get from this is that if we do break this uh area here where is it let me find it if we break this line here this this white middle line we're gonna have roughly two months of a super cycle and i think it's gonna be parabolic really prices are just gonna shoot up super high and maybe it was two months from now so we're in september now october november we could see the top of the market by november guys and again where does where does it put us by november look at the rainbow chart in a great way to look let's just zoom it in for a minute so you know november if it lets us hover here we go so look at the date that's december uh that's, we're looking for the 11th here we go november so the top of the market of november will put it around 168 160 170 168 something like that in november oh, that's the 10th uh 11th there you go november so 170,000 ish is what we could be looking at should it play out like that so i'm gonna keep my eye on that as well and if you're a patreon everything that i've shown you you're seeing it first guys if you're watching my youtube and you don't want to miss this stuff because i tell you i like to keep my patrons on point make sure they're prepared become a patreon i have seven tiers take your pick i recommend going for this uh, one right here like my exclusive vip partner because this one unlocks my buys my sales my stakes everything my alerts you can see when i'm gonna sell when i'm gonna buy okay so that one is important go for that one if you want that little bit more grab my ceo partner tier you know you because with this you get my super alerts exclusive access to my vip telegram group where we talk i i talk to them about stuff way before i even buy it way before i sell it or anything okay so this is why it makes sense to come into that you know because it, it could give you that really really good super alert might help you in your journey we've got 24 hour voice chat service so if anyone wants to start a call you can chat it set it up you know i could be in there talking to you and laughing and whatnots and learning we're dropping some interesting things in uh, over there high profile crypto users you best believe They've got some knowledge in this space. You're dealing with high crypto users. So, yeah, come over to there. There, there. Come over to there. <laughs> Uh, not even cut it we're all fishing a guy like tesco's member uh and look if you want to look 10 percent off right now if you grab an annual package so grab the annual package have it for the year it's going to guide you on your journey truly uh and yeah uh, you know whatever tier is best for you so i think i've covered everything in this now you can play this back in your own time you know, really look at the key important things that i've said if it was helpful to you please drop that like give me a subscribe if you're new watching thank you for watching big up to you all and yeah i'm gonna do a shout out to my patrons there's new patrons coming in there's some going i'm gonna update my list thank you for your patience guys really appreciate everyone's support and yeah i'm gonna be giving new names or maybe in the next video okay so yeah are you ready for this long last list shout out to <laughs> Toy and Ottery, it's time, AJ, Frank C63, Clarence Denison, Denison, look, I'm messing up with it. Christopher Johnson, uh, Wiz Honor, Mr. Anonymous, Suad Shuckler, uh, Carlos Rocha, Damaris, Dan Cox, Why Hold God, Dante Kennedy, uh, Bizzle, Max, Wisdom, Manny Sanchez, Tyron Samuel, Abby Ola, Rachel Mack, Pamela Williams, Stacks and Racks, Rick, Joffrey Williamson, Omar Thomas, Casper Nell, CCP269, Goodfields Nice, Dominic, uh, Peter Stoddart, 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 
I've got tea in it. Uh, Eric Scoop King, Semyon, Fatima Price, Shonda Owens, Tana McLaren, Kevin Ward, Sassafi, Michael Keel, Christopher Haas, Christie, Snowy, D. Oh, no, hold on, hold on. That's not squirrel. Andrew Harding, Kelvin, William Fox, Estra, Claudette Tomiliosa, like Wingardium Leviosa. Ooh, just float you up in the air, you best believe. <laughs> I sound like Norbit now. You best believe, Norbit. Okay, I can't stop. Uh, Shakir Hussain, Lamar Lee, Silly, Cody Harris, S. Cyril, <laughs> Norbit. <laughs> you do it. <laughs> I can't start. Uh, my, you, I can't start. Cyril, Alexander Alfari, Gilbert Blag Baggins, Eric Jackson, Paul Forrest, Powell, uh, I think that's right, Russell Cohan, Joseph Marcus, Crypto Mac. Listen, there's loads, I promise you. Give me the games, Videx, West A, Mo C, Fiat Justin, uh, Mike V, J Fave, Terry JC, Ollie, Orville Broomfield, NASA, Ignacio! Just flick that wand out of your hand. <laughs> it sounds like a Harry Potter spell, wouldn't it? Ignacio, just flick it out of your hand. G Crypto, I love it. G Crypto Lumen 7, 7. Chris Chico, NM That Man, Francis Loco, Zach Adam, Man Sauer, Jem de Jagra, Marcus Gittery. It's Elios. Now that's the one, isn't it? <laughs> that's the one that flicks out your hand. It's Elios. Wicked. Mash up your head. <laughs> Stony Mac, John Lowe, Ranjo Singh, Aiden, Educate or Corey. Blah, spin you around. You. I just love it. Luke Ainsworth, Mr. Do Right. Anthe Are you guys doing this on purpose? Like, are you making up these names? I don't know. Just, uh, Anthony Berry, TRG Investments, Ryan Williams, Tukan Crit. Oh, crazy Jam, Timothy J. Brusky, UKMC, No Name, Pablo, Pablo, Le Lena 111, Sunny V, Hany Abu, Ricardo Vinegar, Shinadu, Oscar Vilgas, Crypto Moon, New to You, Jackson Tepa, Francis Hernandez, Akbar. Like, Akbar, I love it. I got, you know, I've got family with the name Akbar. Uh, Jem Jermaine Allen. Yeah, trust me, I've got family all over the place. Uh, David Adeleji, Chiquita. Hello. John Sandoval, Optimus Prune Page, Edgar Cortez, Ramil TV. Big up, bruv. Kirsten. Hello. Mr. Drew, SNCCC, Mullin Duddy, Albers, Joshua Asher, Black Ape, Bob Rust, Eloy, Mikey, User X2019, Black Star, Chiles, there's two names, Chiles Creations, Akis, Voderus. Rush you up. I don't know, just, I can just say it. Ab Have I said that? Abba say Moises D. Lopez, Michael, um, Joseph Samara, Neona London, Chris Tap Dances. You the best tap dance with you too. Uh, <laughs> Iris, what am I for? Joey J, Raj T, Br Brian Reedy, Terry, Connor Goodman, Sarpen Shing, Dennis Boomer, Mark Peak. I told you there was loads. I'm not joking. There's loads of patrons. Royal ID, Hassan P, Makuga. There's a reason why they become it as well. Mon Monica Matteo, Adam Allen. What's going on my screen though? Uh, where am I? Ralph Green, Marcus Dunbar, Johnny Matthews, Moises Gallery. Is that Master's going? Mrs. Carla V. Hello, Rizwan, A Kings, Ice Cat Trader, Connie, Williamson Johnson, Anthony Donne, Karen, Dan Karen Danik, uh, Kimberly Gim, and All for One. One for All. Cylindale to Shima. Tishim, Tishima, I said about Stefan, PC World, you best believe. Marky27, Dave, uh, Crypto Newbie, Tom, oh, I'm so down. Thomas Rodriguez, Golden, ba Golden Bags, Noel21, Jew Tam, Thierry, Joe Youssef, Arif Joy, Danny Rich, yep, yeah. Elstein, Carnivore 444, Morgan Culver, Joe, Cal, I don't know, Pashkma, Ale Alexis Pagan, I think that's right, Seraf X, Kevin V, Crypto Hustle, Nova, like, I've got to scroll up now, like, this bit so, so long as I've done this. I can't go on. It's been so long since I've done this. I did, I've not even cut it. Rough edge again. Let's go. Where am I? Muhammad Imran, Ankus Jane, Corey, Mario L, Elijah A. Lindy. I think that's right. Moinu Hussain, Eddie Laform, D. Wheels, Riyad Minikasso. I think that's right. Uh, Hash Matala, Sura Rashid, Eamon Deep Whaler, Miss, Miss, Mas, Masikso, Master J, Daniel Brown, DJ Crypto, Adam Istvan, LD, Vincent Millet, Mauricio, A. Noop, N. Uh, a man Rizvi, Janetta or Janetta, uh, Legend Charles Knight, Asa, Asa Jones, Carrie, Gilbo Blaggins, Jake Ross, Cookie Crumbs, Cookie, uh, <laughs> Christian Lee, Phil I gotta have fun of it, guys. Philip Staffer, fund me now. I will sort you out. You best crypto that crypt dive. Oh, Mr. Uh, Maha Ramadan, Fears Ahead, Jim, Harsha, Bent. Benty? Bent? Hanson? Hanson. Uh, Daniel Grigbyu, I think that's right. Idol Piper. Sherry T. Zostek, said it right. Dishanovation. I was saying your name in my dream. I don't know what. I was just. Dishanovation. Why was I saying. I was saying your name. Mustafa. Hold tight, DJ Skylark. I'm in a place with a DJ Skylark. I scroll up my screen with a DJ Skylark. You best believe in a DJ Skylark. I carry on a DJ Skylark. <laughs> Skylark. Hey. <laughs> Love it. Because she's a DJ. Liz Reed. <laughs> just love him. The A-Team, 
Jacob Medeiros, Dave Catho, Richard Harmer, Kyle Dawson, JP Deleen, Deleen, Jerry Shawns. Jerry Listen, I can't have fun. Are you laughing? <laughs> Because I am a- Akeem Bates, Rosemary Hansen, Justin Levin, Via Financial, or Via, because you know, American Save, yeah, Raycorn, Mr. Pauniti, Massey, Toyin Adikibi, listen, I'm almost there, I promise you, I think I'm halfway. Too many Patreons! I appreciate you all, you best believe. Where am I? Uh, I don't know, let me do it again. Seer Coins, Soul Seeker, Fear This, I'm really trying fast. Pablo Baptista, I, I don't know, Anigo Zubieri, I think that's right. Stefan Grunfield, I think that's right. RGC Visual, Lee Goodwin, <laughs> DJ Skyler, Matthew Wood, Christian Miles, Joe, John, H- you best stay, stay a pitch on forever, Skylark, because I need to keep doing that. John Hung, Saif Rahman, Laurie Litra, Alicia Abagas, same with, uh, what's her face? Uh, Wingardium Levinosa, Re- that's the one. Nimu Wambugu, Wambugu? Let me know. David Lane, because sometimes I mess it up. Sayita, Danny Ruddick, Kenny Broker, Aaron Nguyen, Nick Smith, Nas- Nazar, uh, James Snowden, Mr. Bonds, Double Starred, Mustaf, hold on, Mustak Dean, listen, there's so many, Michael Knight, Esther L, Nate, Robert, uh, John Carte, J- Josh Davis, Batch One, VJ Kumar, uh, Fuchs, Francis B, Christopher Hamilton, I'm promised I'm almost there now, <laughs> this is so many, uh, Arino Lorenzo, Raphael Stepnikowski, Jordan Rutty, Jew- uh, Gene Gerrard, Saif, Matthew Kirk, I promise you, if you're still here, big up to you, <laughs> you better drop another like just in case, <laughs> just in case what, Peter Butler, Saif Mahith, I think that's right, Martin Wehenko, big up to you brother, Amin, no, Amin, is it Amin, I want to say Amin, A-M-I-N-E, let me know, Jack Attack, just attack you, you know. <laughs> uh, I can't remember. Mirage, hold on. Mirage Shepherd? Mirage? Yeah. Uh, Jimma R- Richardson? Jimma Richardson, isn't it? Valentine, work hard, play hard. Uh, Sean A- Sean Angus. Miss, is it like an Angus burger? Mr. Crypto Noob, Theodos Jansen, Cosmic Mo- Momos, yeah? Block number 23. Is that where you got your money, yeah? Because <laughs> I'm the block number... Anyway. Adrian Kazoni? I think that's right. Ken Zepi- Zepeda. Is it Zepeda? Because, oh, it's just straight out of Zepeda. Ada Matthew, Andrew Evans, Dan4666, you know, Cosmos. Uh, S- Simo Ahmed? Ahmed? Let me know. Ross, uh, T- Tobian Raka, Michael Thompson, Ben Evans, Iv- Ivan? I'm almost there. Ken Santos, Bruno Ball, uh, Colour with Courtney, Victor New... New? NGO, NGO, let me know, uh, Dez, Tyrese X, Just Josh, and Aaron Valox. my god, <laughs> thank you so much, what a call, <laughs> if you're still here, please drop that like, thank you, I truly appreciate all my patrons, you must believe, I appreciate everyone, you guys as well watching, if you're still here, thank you so, so much, and I look forward to seeing you in my next video, cheers!